Hey you guys, so it has been a couple of days since we shared a video. We have actually been on a fast this week uh, with some sister friends of mine in ministry and that included not being on social media other than for marketing purposes. So today I'm coming to you with a video just showing you how I'm gonna retwist my hair um, using our Glowhead products. And I'm gonna be showing you the products I'm gonna use for my retwist because my hair is looking a little dry very dry, I might add. And yeah, so let's Okay, so the first product we're gonna use is our Glowhead um, Hydrating Leave-In Conditioner. And if you're in North Carolina, you can purchase this locally at Salon Glow by Rashida. You already know that I'll share with you and I'm gonna be putting on makeup if you're not, and some concealer. We have a skincare, incredible skincare line coming out. I've been telling you all about that. And we've just, FYI, this is such a side note, but we started selling color cosmetics and skincare back in 2009 under our Glamic Cosmetics brand. You might've heard me accidentally say Glamic Cosmetics, I think in my last video. Um, but we're revamping the line, changing a whole lot of things about the products that we're gonna be offering because we're super interested and in, into caring about what goes on the skin, what goes on the hair, what goes on just everything because the skin is the largest organ, right? And I don't know, it just matters. So anyway, I digress. We're gonna start out with our hydrating leave-in conditioner. And we're just gonna spray it all over. And remember, I'm not trying to do any type of a, um, wash and go, because I don't have that type hair texture. My hair is not the type of texture where you can say, oh, we're just gonna I spray my eyes. <laughs> well, we could just say we're gonna wet it and set it and call it a day. I just don't have that type of hair texture. And that's fine, because our products are for all hair types, all hair colors, all hair kinds, with, doesn't matter your nationality. These products work on everyone's hair. So white, black, Asian, Hispanic, Pacific Islander, it doesn't matter. Our products, men, women, children, our products are for you. With the exception of our vitamin line, you um, can't be a child and take the vitamin line. They're for teenagers and adults only. So, we also talked about it. We're gonna be adding a curly girl line um, we haven't done that yet, but it is in the works, and that is for someone that specifically has super curly type hair um, and all that jazz, and we'll go over that more when we get to that, when we introduce that product. So, so now I've dampened my hair, and now I'm gonna use our anti-itch hair growth oil, and I was sharing with you that my edges are growing back. We're getting tons of testimonies about people's hair growing back, and so we're not claiming that this is a hair growth oil, but what we are claiming that it promotes healthy hair growth, right? It promotes healthy hair, stimulates the scalp, which then promotes and can help aid in your hair growth. And then also we have our vitamins, which I'll be sharing with you. I'm not gonna take one on camera today because I haven't eaten, because remember I said we're on a fast, so I don't wanna eat it and then get sick on the stomach or anything like that. So I wasn't gonna put this on my scalp, but I'm like, why not? I'm already in my hair and doing my hair and so I just opened it up and I'm just adding it to my scalp and then we're just gonna massage it in. So if you wanna stimulate blood flow, which is to your scalp, which is a great way to also promote hair growth, right? So whenever you have products that are stimulating to the scalp and when you also add to that stimulation. So when you add to that stimulation, it's just really great for the hair and it's gonna promote hair growth. So what I'm gonna do, I think I didn't put any in the front. So what I'm gonna do is now, after we rub this all in, cause I'm not in a hurry, but I'm in a, like I don't want this to take all day. I'm not even gonna um, part my hair. I'm just gonna do, I don't know y'all, now I'm kinda like, forget it. Maybe I'm not gonna too straight. <laughs> I'm kinda liking what it's doing. But anyway, I'm gonna refreshen it, right? Because it certainly looks better now with some products added into it than it did a second ago by me not having anything in it. Because guess what? Water is the best hydration and the best ingredient for healthy hair. Who knew, right? So that's why it's good for you to drink. So now what I'm gonna do with our um, anti-itch and hair growth oil, which all of our products are vegan friendly, I'm gonna put a little bit on my hand and I'm gonna rub it throughout my hair, not a lot. Right, don't need a lot. So now I'm just gonna rub it all over my hair just to give my hair some shine. Just a little bit of healthy shine. Shine, shine, shine. Right? And I don't need a lot. Let's just say I don't want a lot. And so now what I'm gonna do, I'm not even gonna like use any type, but see how I was easily just able to go through my hair? My hair is pretty much have a look some grays go flying away, right? I haven't combed through my hair in a minute. 
So I'm just going to do some two strand twists so that I basically can unravel it and my hair will be curly enough where I'll have a style, right? So basically all I was doing was putting, my glasses are moving. <laughs> just kidding, my virtual glasses are moving. So I'm basically just putting these products on there so that I can give my hair some type of shape and some type of style. So what I'm probably not gonna do is retwist all of this. So what I'm gonna do is just add a few twists to my hair in the area where I want some curl definition. And my hair doesn't really, my hair has a Z type pattern. Anybody that studies natural hair or looks at curly hair and curl patterns and things like that, it doesn't even have to be natural hair, just curl patterns in general. You'll know what type of curl you have. I have a Z shaped curl. So that's why I have 4C type hair, which my hair is, um, tends to be dry, right? So then what I'm gonna do is just add a few twists in the front and on top in the areas that tend not to curl as much as everything else. And since my hair got just a little dry on the end, I'll just add a little bit more hydrating leave-in conditioner. Just missed it. And then what I'm gonna do is while I'm getting dressed and putting on makeup and all that jazz, I'm just gonna add five twists. It's gonna go really, really fast, maybe six. But I'm not even having any type of rhyme or reason. You don't have to overthink this. Like a lot of people do take more time with doing their hair, but I'm busy. I ain't got time to be overthinking a hairstyle. And normally I'm so used to having braids. I was like, what was I thinking about taking my braids out? But I have loved having my hair out. I don't necessarily miss the braids yet. I think I did miss them one day when I couldn't think of anything to do to my hair because even though I did hair for so long, I was never good at doing my own hair. Anybody else experience that? Like you're really great at doing other people's hair, but when it comes to doing your own hair, you like totally suck at it. That's me. But you know, I let you in on my little weaknesses or whatever, my kryptonites. So we're gonna do this one. A little bit more of our Go ahead, leave in conditioning treatment. And my hair feels good, smells good. So the last product I'm gonna put a little bit on is Seekening Silkening Heat Protector and Shine, which I really don't need a lot of because I'm not putting any heat on my hair, but I just figured it'd be a nice um, sheen to add to my hair. And that's all, just to give it some serum and all that jazz because I have blow dried my hair before and I'm basically just sprucing up the shine. That's all. So then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to let these dry and then I'm going to get dressed and put my makeup on and all that stuff. I'm going to come back and I will untwist the pieces that you see here, which will show you, hey, so even though I didn't do anything back here, but just fluff it out a little bit. This, by able to have some curl definition here, is gonna make it look more like a style. And then if I choose to, I'm gonna use some of our edge control gel. I'm not sure if I will or not, but I may just to. Okay, you guys, so I lied, I'm not putting on makeup. The filter has eyelashes. I did put on lipstick, but I haven't done my eyebrows. But let's go ahead and take our twist out. And then you'll see what I mean. See how that gave me some texture? Whereas before when I didn't have any product on my hair, it wouldn't have really given me any texture. And then if it had a, it probably wouldn't have stayed all day, right? So I'm going to meet my clients to sell a house today. So I definitely need my hair to be looking like something. And I used a skincare product that we're sampling. Um, I used a um, green tea scrub. I used a really yummy toner anti-aging toner and I used face oil. So we have this really incredible oil for the face because I didn't feel like using a cream-based moisturizer. And it's an oil that really goes into the skin well. So we're just testing out products to see. Okay, awesome. So now what we're gonna do is we're just gonna take a little bit on our finger. Y'all have seen me do this 20 million times. Look at that lay down right there. Mm -hmm. And look, this is all I use. I'm just gonna try to put enough on my finger so you can see it. I mean, it's not even hardly any on there. Don't worry, it's not getting on my, my glasses. Those aren't mine. <laughs> I know that that might not be funny to you, but I tickle myself. Um, anyway, so.
So look how that lays down my edges. I'm gonna do one more little 